Hey everyone, this is Ken I Chris. It is uh, 0606 hours at 6.06 a.m. I'm just out of the uh, sleep study, Crestview. Um, it was an interesting experience. Um, the room wasn't really a hospital room. It was like, like in the 80s. It had like some old fashioned furniture. But <laughs> yeah, bed was seen these beds like long like decades ago uh, a small room which I hated but uh, they did have a TV in there which was kind of weird um, but you know I didn't watch it or anything you know when I was sleeping I mean I didn't put the t TV on or anything like that because I think some people they sleep with the TV on so that's why um, but they did have a fan uh, and that was a good thing uh, because I love fan noise and I, you know, I have to have a fan all year on so that was a great thing. And then, uh, what other things? Yeah. Yeah, then, and then the, the tech was really, really awesome guy. He had like 30 years in, so he knew what the hell he was doing. And, uh, but then they had to stop putting those sticky things on. And he's trying to, I, and I have a ton of hair. So I was like, wait, and he's like, oh, I got to put him in. He's trying to put up the, you know, the, the locations where it doesn't freaking tear and go, all right you know so anyway so so he got him on my my calves and stuff and chest area whatever case may be and uh they you know then they put a bunch of wires on there you have to feed it through because i had sleeping pants i had my plaid nice sleeping pants nice and comfy i even wore socks and i don't wear socks to bed but i don't know this place man <laughs> i'm wearing a pair of socks like it was ankle socks but anyway so then um and then they had to do the head, so and he uses a grease grease pencil. He uses a grease pencil in my freaking head, the whole thing. And then he puts the gooey stuff and then puts all the wires on there and all that good stuff. And then he puts the thing on your finger. And uh then he hooks you up on the device and all that good, and then he's like, Alright. There you go, and so go to sleep. <laughs> okay. So but we had to do some tests, you know, like you know, blink five times breathe in, hold it, breathe out, wiggle your, your toes and stuff like that, you know, basically, you know, move a little, you know, move your eyes to the left and right, back and forth, you know what I mean, it's all that good stuff, and then he says, good night, and then I was like, okay, so I went to sleep, I think, but I was up all night, like, I would wake up and look around, you know, or my legs were, you know, didn't feel right all night long, you know, so, but, I don't know. He was watching. I was trying to sleep. So, um, and then after five in the morning, good morning. And I'm like, all right. And I just woke right up. And he goes, bright light. And that room has bright light. It's like one of those hospital lights on top. And then, um, and then I'm like, <sighs> woke up. Felt like a vampire, you know, burn it up. <laughs> bright light, bright light. Anyways, but, um, so I am in the car. So it'll take about two or three weeks to uh, get the results. So I'm going to go back home. I'm going to chill. I'm going to eat breakfast. And I'm going to take uh, the morning off from the gym and see how I feel in the afternoon time frame after my counseling session. And I'll go from there. All right. Got to get out of here. Can I, Chris, out? Peace. Love you all. Sleep study finally done. Yay.